guys, it is launch day. Okay, everything is ready to go. It's launched to my patrons and I've already had an order. Oh, guys, we have a malfunction. Anyway, I've put it on loud. I've put it on loud. And for the first time today, I've heard the ka -ching. Guys, it is launch day! Welcome back to my channel, welcome to a new studio vlog. This is the day in the life of a launch day. How are we gonna, how are we gonna describe this video? We'll figure it out. You'll see by the title of this video what we end up choosing, but it is launch day and I'm bringing you along with me. It is currently 20 to nine in the morning. We've been for a lovely walk, as you would have seen, and it's time to sit down, get the journal out and plan for the day. I'm launching the shop, well, the secret password to my Patreons first at 10 a.m., so in like two hours. <laughs> and then we had an issue. I set up a wait list, which if you guys, had signed up. Thank you so so much for that. However, I it it just hasn't worked, and I don't know why. So I will look into it. So I'm thinking of just apologising to everyone and just sending my whole email emailing list early access because I don't have time to fix it. And yeah, it's just part. You know, that's just one mistake. One mistake of the day. Hopefully, no more to come. Hello. Welcome, and if you're new here, my name is Beck, and I'm creator and owner of Rebel Germs, a quiet stationery shop, and you are currently on the journey with me to making this full time. It's just all happening, and I'm just really hoping that this launch goes well, and I'm just hoping that people are excited. I think people are excited. I'm really, really excited to finally be bringing back the journals, obviously launching a new one, restocking the other one, and the pens, and I'm just really, really excited. So, let's get cracking, let's plan out the day, and let's have a successful launch day, shall we? everything is ready to go for my patrons so i'll be sending that link out to them with the password in less than an hour i just realized that i haven't had a, a launch day like this for a while my past launch launch days i've either been in starbucks or i have had like things booked in with friends i haven't 
been able to do a full launch day in the studio for a long time and it feels really nice because I'm able to kind of, like you would have seen then, me changing my banner a few times, noticing that it wasn't small enough for the mobile phone version and noticing that I didn't, I wanted the journals to be next to each other and it's those little things that I know that if I didn't have today fully in here, I would have just done it and not thought of it because they're just things that aren't there's like in my mind there would have been more important things so it's nice to pay attention to the little details so I'm really really happy and yeah I feel a bit lost like I don't know what to do even though I've written a to-do list I've done my banner I just need to get the post up I'm going to schedule the post now to my patrons and yeah I will check back in with you when I when it goes live to my patrons and let's see if anything any orders come through I don't I don't know I don't know uh, I don't know but yeah see you in a bit <laughs> Was just distracted and forgot that uh, it's launched to my patrons and I've already had an order that's what like maybe oh Levine oh my gosh okay uh, I'm all distracted I was <laughs> I was like watching the time and then you know when you just stop watching the time right let's head over to my live view see if there's oh we have people on there Okay, so Levine has been, Levine is the first person to order. And that doesn't surprise me. Levine, thank you so, so much. I know you watch these vlogs. You were the first freaking order. So thank you so, so much. What did you order? Let's have a look. Oh, people are coming on. Yes, she ordered the what can I say? I just love stationary pins. So now we have eight left. I actually counted. I have nine. Well, now we have eight. Oh my gosh, people. Oh my gosh, people. Oh, oh we had another order. Oh my gosh, <clears throat> Simone! Oh my gosh, Simone, what did you order? Oh my god, we've just had our first journal bundle order! Simone! Simone ordered the Journey Starts Now journal, which is on a uh, bundle, which is the journal, the pen, and the pencil case. And she ordered the What Can I Say I Just Love li I can't talk. What Can I Say I Just Love Stationery Pen? Pen! Oh my gosh, I'm a bit starstruck. Is that the right word? Whoa, there's six people on there already. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Um, I need to post this in my stories. This is incredible. Very, very grateful for you guys. Patrons, if you're watching this, thank you so freaking much. Um, oh my God, we have nine people on the site. What is going on? This is crazy. Oh my gosh. Okay, oh, there's 10, there's 10 people. Okay, right. Just gonna, just gonna wait and see. So, I've just been getting everything prepared because I want to kind of pack as we get the orders because I've never been able to do that. So I wanted to make sure I did that this time. I just want to make sure that orders are out and when it comes to the day where I have to go for surgery, I don't have to worry about anything. Everyone's got their orders. And it's all freaking dandy, you know? We have some of my patrons. I was just talking to them on the Rebels chat. But I think there's a few of my patrons that are launching today as well. Oh, Kelly's live. Hello, welcome back to the shop. So, as you saw yesterday at the top of the bookmark, um, and we've got kind of a spaced out pattern. On the front and on the back, it's really nice love that girl kelly if you're watching this i freaking love you i'm so proud of you <gasps> we just had another order oh levine levine's ordered again <laughs> levine, why? what why 
are you ordering again? <laughs> Ordered both. Right, I'll have to transfer you your shipping because you've just paid shipping twice. <laughs> Oh, Levine ordered the Dream Plan Do pencil case, the Journey Starts Now pencil case, and the Journey Starts Now pen. That's the first pen. Wow. Oh, Levine, what are you like? Oh, gosh. Wow. Okay. I am going to just leave that there for people, and I am going to crack on with the rest of the to-do list. I need to get this email out ready, and I kind of want to design a sticker because I haven't designed a freebie sticker for July and I feel bad for that and I want to, I've got a, an image or a design in my head and I want to bring it to life and it will be, it will relate to this launch. So yeah, let's design a sticker, get it printed, get it made and then we can get the email ready to send out for 12 p.m. to my mailing list subscribers and yeah oh my gosh i'm so overwhelmed i'm so freaking overwhelmed okay i'm just sorting out the emails we had another order i was watching kelly's live because i think well i know she launched some items today so i'll link her below and she got some lovely orders and i'm so proud of her and i'm proud of you if you're watching it kel so i am just setting up this email ready to go and be sent in an hour and a half. Let me just quickly go through everyone that has placed an order. So these are my Patreon orders, and of course, I sent out an early bird link to my Patreons, and yeah, we've had four orders so far, which is amazing, and I'm so, so grateful. And the orders that I got were from Levine, Simone. The latest order was from Laura and Laura ordered the Journey Starts Now pencil case, the What Can I Say, I Just Love Stationery pen, the Journey Starts Now clear sticker, the Journey Starts Now ballpoint pen. And Laura, if you're watching this, your note is so, so sweet. And I'm so sorry that it's so expensive to ship the journals to the US. I will have a little look into it if there's any way of me bringing down the price or whatever I'll have a good look at it but and let you know but I am so so grateful for your order like thank you so so much congratulations to your daughter getting married um oh my gosh she's my age and she's getting married on the 10th of the 10th uh, which is crazy so congratulations but Laura thank you so so much um, and yeah thank you to all my patrons that have ordered so far I am gonna crack on with this email now and get that done and ready and then I can just like well I can print out orders and I can start packing orders I might go live and pack orders <laughs> okay right emails So I have just scheduled this email that will be going out at 12pm and yeah, honestly, this isn't a sponsored video but I use Omnisend and it has honestly changed the game for me. Like, I know I talk about it all the freaking time but I'm just so grateful to finally find something that works emailing wise so yeah like always i'll leave my link to omni send down below because i'd highly recommend giving it a go you can try it for free or you can sign up to the 16 pound a month one which is what i started on and now i'm on the pro but i can't believe i'm actually making revenue now from omni send it's incredible anyway so this is yeah it's all done it's all ready <sighs> Now I've got to make some reels ready for the launch and for this week, uh, next week.
some lovely orders that my patrons have placed already. My email is now gone out to my mailing list, so we might have some orders maybe coming through whilst we're on this live, and I'm trying to pack orders as they come in, which I've never done before. Um, um, oh, we've just had an order. We've just had... Oh, Lauren, thank you so much. What has Lauren ordered? The pin. Yeah, the pin's gonna sell out, I think. Oh, that's my packaging. Babe, there's people go there's my packaging's at the door. Do you mind grabbing it? Thank you. If you don't mind bringing it up, that'd be great. Thanks, babe. We just had another order. We just had another freaking order. What the heck? Well, guys, this is amazing. Thank you, guys, if you're on the website. Like I said, I've sent the password. Oh, we just had another order. <laughs> what the heck? Gosh, it's going crazy. <laughs> this is mad. Oh, oh, we've had another order. What the heck? We had two, have we had two orders? Claire for the pin and Denise for the pin and the pencil case Jenny sells now. Right. So it is currently quarter past three. Um, I've got an email scheduled, like a booster email scheduled to go out at 6 p.m. and a reel that needs, I think I need to edit, finish editing that reel actually. Right, let's just talk about this freaking launch. Blown away. <laughs> like you would have seen me packing, like packing some of the orders live and um, just yeah orders coming through because I sent out the email that was meant to go to my waitlist as you know I sent it out to everyone on my mail uh, emailing everyone on my subscribers list because I messed up the waitlist so I just sent it out and yeah we have currently how many orders have we had today so we've had a total of 14 orders so far. So that's from Patreon and my main list. I haven't spoken about it. Like I haven't like opened it up to anyone else yet. So we'll see if any more orders come through. I don't know if they will, but I like, I am so, so grateful guys. I have had a very good day of sales and that number is pretty unreal. I have sold out of the Journey Starts Now pencil cases. There is one, so actually, while you're, when you're watching this, I will be recovering from surgery. So I am determined to fix this wait list. And I'm hoping by the, when I come back from recovering, I can do a mini little restock launch of the pencil cases, the Journey Starts Now pencil cases that have gone so, so well and the what can I say just love stationery pin but sign up to my mailing list down below and I can tell you when things come back in stock I'm so so grateful it's such a scary thing I was gonna take a month off my business anyway because I have so much stuff to do for my wedding however this obviously my surgery got rescheduled and it came at the perfect time so I'm take I need I need to take the time off anyway so yeah but it's scary it's really really scary and the fact that I did my pop-up in Kenji that went pretty well and mystery Monday packs launch this month and then obviously this launch it helps massively and of course you guys watching my vlogs commenting liking everything it all helps and supports me and of course my patreon speakers literally don't know where i'd be without them so yeah i'm just i'm just feeling very grateful and i'm feeling like whew. so i've had top and i've had some lunch i treated us to some we've got 
Peri... Pe no, what's it called? Pepe's? It's up in Caffili, it's up where we live and oh, it was lunch. I had the chicken, rice, chips, Peri, Peri, Peri Mayo. Delish. But I want a freaking ice cream because it's boiling outside so I'm gonna go get us an ice cream. We're gonna walk Bren, get us an ice cream and enjoy the rest of the day. Go to the gym and then chill this evening. Uh, I've started packing orders. I am going to be recording a ASMR packing video for YouTube so you can, at least I have a couple of videos. Well, I'm hoping to have three videos post up on here whilst I'm away. So yeah, that'll be one of them. Now, let's go and get some frickin' ice cream because I'm frickin' starving. Oh, guys, we have a malfunction. I've literally just come back from the gym, sweating my, I was gonna say boobs off. That's pretty rude, isn't it? I don't know. I'm sweating my boobs off though. And does anyone else just struggle with 4G? I remember the days when 4G was just a thing and it worked and now it decides to just not work. Even if I get 5G, it doesn't work. Right, restrict password. <sighs> Let's hope nothing's fudged up on the reel. Unless my Instagram is gonna keep glitching, which would be, yeah, it is. Fudge in hell. Uh, why? Why? Why, why, Lola? Oh, there you go. Reel is being posted all live for everyone else. I knew it would do it. Oh well. This is another thing that it does. It changes the font on there. That's not the font that I picked, but because I've saved it as a draft and re-upload and then edit and then like uploaded it, it changes my fonts. Does anyone else struggle with that? Oh well. It's not aesthetically pleasing, but it has been such an incredible day and I am gonna talk you through my sales and everything. Hey, right, that's live. It's all live. It's all live. It's all officially live. Bryn, are you gonna come and celebrate with me? Bryn? Bryn, come. Bryn, you come. You are ignoring me. You're rude. <laughs> Anyone else's dog like to ignore them? Mine sure frickin' does. <sighs> it's been, like, incredible to hear so I always have my phone on silent and I unsilenced it it's not the word I can't talk it's this is what happens I can't talk anyway when we reach the end of the day it's just a no-go from me anyway I've put it on loud I've put it on loud and for the first time today I've heard the ka -ching sounds from Shopify and I've been walking like to get ice cream and we were walking there and back and I was um, we were walking there and I heard a ka -ching and Tom was like oh, and I was like it's an order and then we got back and we were opening the door and it was ka -ching! and I was like oh god I got another order and I was just saying to Tom it just never gets old <laughs> oh my god we've had our first we've had our first order already from 6 p.m launch oh my gosh who Guys, I I don't think I've ever done this for, I've never done this freaking well. This is mad. Oh, Sandra, the Jenny Star Style Journal. This makes me so happy. Thank you so much, Sandra. I will obviously be thank, th be thank you, <laughs> be thanking everyone at the end of this vlog. I'll be putting everyone's names so far that has ordered and I'm just so, so so grateful and there's three people on there there's people on there i honestly i'm honestly not expecting loads of orders and um, oh my god there's five people yeah i wasn't expecting any more orders really because my patrons had early access and then i sent it out to my whole emailing list um and i've been so blown away with the support um, from this collection, I think it's actually starting to hit hit me how um, amazing it's been. I am over. I'm over the moon. I've had 18 orders so far. 
you know what, it just, just takes me, just reminds me how years ago I wished to be where I am now. It's pretty, pretty amazing and it shows that hard work pays off and I'm proud of myself. I have always been someone that has believed that I can do it. It's taken a lot longer than I would have liked, but at the same time, I'm actually quite glad that this has been my journey and that it's taken me over six years to get to a point where I can quit my part-time job, hopefully soon, and that I have launches that do this well and that people recognize me at events and so it's, it's honestly it's honestly incredible i'm not gonna get emotional because i'm sweating and i don't want water coming from my eyes because it's coming from everywhere else right let's let's have a little chat shall we guys <sighs> oh my god i've just had my <sighs> just had my biggest order. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. I just had the biggest order of my life. Oh my god. What? What is going on? Melinda? If you watch these, if you watch these vlogs, oh my god, you actually made me cry. What the hell? I don't actually know what to say. Um, thank you. Oh my god, I've never ever like. I and you come all the way to this, from the states, and I was able to see that thing on the the map. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, Melinda, I um, I uh, I am so grateful. Thank you so much. That is mad. Oh, you got the last. The journey starts now. Bundle. Wow. <laughs> This is hands down been my most successful launch ever and I am a bit shocked. <laughs> um, thank you, thank you so so much. Oh I just had another order. I'm gonna message Melinda and she can have a free seconds pin because she deserves it because she what she said that she missed the what can I say I just love stationery pin and um, they are sold out so I'm gonna message her and say they're sold out I can either give her like a really like a second one of the seconds pins and I'll just give, give it to her for free because I that that is like my biggest order ever and um, Oh, Melinda. Gemma! Gemma, what did you order? You got the pen! And a Sacretary Blossom sticker sheet. Oh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm a bit shocked. Right, um, I'm gonna go quickly go on my last live of the day and celebrate with everyone online. And then I'm gonna come on here and have a really honest chat with you guys and also go through my stats for the day and how much I made, um, as in sales, the products I made. I'll go through everything with you, all my stats. So I will see you in a bit, but I'm gonna go live first and celebrate with my my Instagram followers. Gonna, I'm doing my last live of the day. I've come back from the gym. I've done a gym session. I'm, yeah, I wanted to pop on Look at that, I know, I know I look absolutely crazy. I wasn't gonna come on alive, but you guys are next freaking level. I have never had 
a launch go so well in my life. This was, this has been insane. And I have documented the whole day. Things that have sold out. We've sold out of the, what can I say, this pin. We've sold out of this very much loved pin. What can I say, I just the stationery pin. That's sold out. We've sold out of the Journey Starts Now pencil cases. We've sold out of the Journey Starts Now bundles. I remember the long drives to late nights in your car. I remember. Okay, guys, I've just come off the live. Um, I just wanted to go on to say thank you to everyone because I'm just, I'm, I'm still like in shock with how well everything's gone. Um, and yeah, I wanted to just end the vlog by obviously going through my stats, but just telling like explaining to you guys how we're all on our different paths this is how i'm trying to word it in the correct way we are all on our own journeys when it comes to starting our small businesses or a new career path each each journey is different and for years when i started rebel jones i was like waiting for that moment that my business would blow up a reel would go crazy on instagram or i don't know i'd be i'd be found somewhere i don't know and it never happened for me and i watched my small business friends blow up on social media and do incredibly well and it was amazing to watch but it also was hard because I was like, why hasn't this happened for me? And now six and a half years down the line, I can confidently say that I'm so glad that it didn't. And I just want to express it to you guys. If you are a small business and you are just starting out or you've been at it a while and you're still, you're at this place where you are questioning yourself why isn't it working for me? What am I doing wrong? Where am I going wrong? All these different questions, true. Those thoughts that you're having aren't true. I used to think like it all the freaking time. I would, yeah, I would just think, why not me? You know, should I just give up? Should I not do this anymore? Is my art not wanted, not liked? all those kind of questions and now I'm just so glad that I never gave up and just kept going and th I'm not kidding things started to get better for me when I really took a step back and thought about what I wanted for my business because for so long I saw what worked for others and tried it out and it never worked for me and I would always ask like wonder why and that's because not ever just because it works for them it doesn't work for you and it's so true and you probably have heard it so many times but it's so so true so ever since I took a step back and accepted that I'm not going to blow up overnight that it is going to be um, a slow burner of a career path or of a, a slow yeah just a slow burner in general and I wanted to accept that things are going to change my business, that I'm, my art style is going to change, my ideas are going to change and it's okay. I was always so scared to change things and yeah, it's just, honestly ever since I've just not really given a crap and just done what I love, it's just changed, it's just changed the game for me and also I feel like all these years of preparation and learning has gotten where I am now and me just not giving up. I would have the thoughts of giving up but I never would because I can't imagine not doing this. I honestly can't and I can't wait to sit down on a vlog and that and the the name of the vlog be I've quit my job because that's the next stage and I think we're close. I've got a date, but I'll keep that a secret until it happens. But I'm I just want I just want you guys to know that if this is what you love to do, please keep doing it. It doesn't 
it's okay if it takes longer than others. I know it can be disheartening and hard to watch sometimes, but trust me, please keep going and enjoy the path that you're on and keep learning and keep changing and evolving. It's just all part of the journey. And yeah, I'm just so glad that I kind of realized that. It was a bit, bit too late, but also not because I find that I feel like things, some things happen for a reason, you know? But yeah, if you are watching this, I just want you to know that I have been in the position, if like, it, if you're in the position that I was talking about previous, I've been there. I think it's because I got this, I got a comment on one of my YouTube shorts the other day that said, I've quit my, my job and I'm, I'm going full time in my business, which is amazing. And they were like, and I want to blow up like you. And that's when I was like, I replied going, firstly, huge congratulations. If you're watching this and you commented on my shorts this is to you i don't know if you've read my comment but a huge congratulations of quitting your job and going for it that is that is a huge step and i'm so excited for you and i'm so proud of you but i was also saying that i haven't blown up i've been doing this for six and a half years and there's still so much more i can learn and there's you know i want to be in a certain place with my business and i'm so i am getting closer to it a bit quicker now but i'm not exactly there yet and yeah, it just takes time and just please enjoy your process and your journey. Now, let's just crack on and talk about the stats for today because I haven't actually really had a look. So I'm going to go over to my dashboard. From my dashboard, it says we've had 125 online store sessions. What? In one day? That's insane. That's essentially, if you don't know what that is, I'm pretty sure you do, but if you don't, that is just people clicking on the link and going onto my shop. We have had a total of £715.63. I actually can't believe I'm saying that number. I have never had a launch that has made that amount of money in one day. What? Like, that's, that's crazy. So, um, yeah, thank you so, so much. And then the total orders were 20. We've had 20 orders today. 20 people have ordered. I've got to remember that the items that have sold, which have made obviously me load the 715, is I've got quite expensive items on the shop or bougie items, maybe I should say, like the journals and the bundles and stuff like that. But 20 orders in one day. I used to dream about that. I used to literally dream about that. Thank you. <laughs> and then the conversion rate is 14.4%. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what that means. Percentage of, percentage of sessions that resulted in online store orders out of the top, ah, out of the total number of sessions, got you. Okay, let's see. Average order value was £30.36, that's interesting. <gasps> top selling products, I've got it, okay. Top selling products were, what can I say, I just love stationery pin, shock. The Journey Starts Now ballpoint pen, amazing. The Journey Starts Now clear sticker, oh my gosh, I didn't realise that. The Journey Starts Now pencil case, obviously, and the Journey Starts Now journal. Wow, oh my gosh, and 63.16% were returning customers, oh wow. Did I tell you how many products we sold today? I wonder how many, I wonder if I can tell you how many products. There you go, 50 products were sold today. Wow, that's incredible. 50 products, yay. Oh my gosh, right, there we have it guys. What an incredible day. I was not expecting it to go this well, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I, I don't know, I keep saying it, but I am insanely grateful. I needed this because obviously I'm off now and yeah you will obviously see some videos that I have pre-recorded whilst I'm away but I am off to get surgery on Thursday I'm getting a bit emotional talk about it because I'm not gonna lie I'm a bit scared <laughs> I um I have terrible health anxiety so you can imagine I think the worst and um, so many people have spoken to me 
I can't believe how many of us struggle with chronic illnesses. It freaking annoys me. But at the same time, I'm also very glad that I have people to talk to. I have some incredible, incredible people around me and I've been able to ask questions and it's so normal for me to think like this, but so many people have done it and yeah, I, I'm just, I'm just, I need to learn how to not think the worst, but it's just me. But anyway, I've got my surgery on Thursday, fingers crossed, and I'll be recovering. Now, I would really, really love to know, guys, because in the last, I think it was the last vlog, I asked for people to type down some emojis or some theme ideas for the Mystery Monday packs, the next ones, which will be launching in September. However, I will have a little look to see what emojis people have put to, for like ne like future Mystery Monday packs, but we need to organise an autumn launch. I can't believe I'm saying it, but we need to organise an, uh, an autumn seasonal launch and I have no idea yet of what to bring to the shop, what kind of theme, so please, please, please comment below some theme ideas, autumnal or Halloween. Would you like to see a pumpkin one again this year? Would you like to see a ghost theme, a witch theme? Just let me know. Like, please, please, please let me know in the comments and I will work on that whilst I am recovering. I can have time to draw and hopefully be a bit creative. So please help me out with that and I will bring that into my Mystery Monday packs and then obviously we'll do, the next launch will be a autumnal launch and I'm getting married <laughs> wow okay right guys if you have enjoyed this video please 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 give it a thumbs up because it means the world and it does actually help this channel massively and make sure to press that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can get notified of the videos that are to come because I'm I'm pretty sure I mentioned it earlier but Next week we have a packing ASMR video going up and then the week after that I sit down and I go through all the tools, I sound really Welsh then, that I use for building my small business. That, I put a poll up on Instagram about that ages a while back and so many people wanted that video so I'm really excited to bring that to you. So yeah, make sure to press that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can get notified of when those go live. I love you, wish me luck for surgery, well when you're watching this I will be recovering so yeah, common away because I need friends to talk to <laughs> but I love you all so so much, thank you for your incredible support and if you have missed out, if you did miss out on this launch I will be doing a little, little mini restock so keep your eyes peeled and make sure to sign up to my mailing list for that but I love you guys, thank you so much for being amazing and I will see you very very soon. Bye guys.